or welcome to Vlogtober 2020, 2020, 2020, uh, 2022 day 5 so thank you so much guys for joining me in this vlog so today I've got a couple of things that I need to do some of the things that I wanted to do this past weekend but because I had to be busy at work and this airplane flying over me is making noise but anyways, that's part of vlogging because the reality needs to be captured as well on the vlog. But anyways, guys, as I was saying, I need to do some few grocery shopping. So I watched a Vlogtober video yesterday, in fact, last night, of a South African YouTuber who inspired me to basically inspire my dinner tonight. Uh, it's something that I also enjoy eating now and again and i haven't eaten that in a very very long time you will find out when we go do shopping during load shedding so i'm going to be load shedded from 10 to 12 30 today so i'm going to use that two hour 30 minutes just to run some errands i've got two gas cylinders that i need to fill i'm going to explain a little bit later what i mean by gas cylinders so for now just just pack it there and also I need uh, to get a book to read because I do buy a book a month. Well, joys of a YouTuber, I ran out of space while I was still talking. So I'm not quite sure what I said earlier, but let's just recap of what I think I said. Uh, during load shedding from 10 to 12.30 today, I'm going to run some errands. Part of the errands that I'm going to be running it's going to be some of my groceries that i usually do every month basically just supplies more than a whole uh grocery stuff that i need to do so i also want to buy some medication and some of the home remedies that i was advised to take for my persistent cough that i've been having for almost a month now which I don't understand why this thing doesn't want to go away. Uh, so I also saw another vlog where I was inspired to buy, you know, the old medication, cough medication we used to buy when, when our parents, no, when our parents used to buy for us when we were kids, the, the ones that we did not like to take, I think those stuff worked back then. So I think going back to the basics is going to also assist. So I'm going to be searching for those medication as well. I'm going to let you know who inspired that one as well for me because I watched the Vlogtober video and I was like, hmm, that's so true. The old medication used to work. Why won't they work now? So yeah, that is another thing that I'm going to be doing. Uh, what else would I want to do? After work, I want to attempt to go and watch Woman King uh, just to relax because people, yo, we've been grinding. Vlogtober has us here, if you know what I mean. So um, I want to go unwind a little bit and come back around uh, 8.30. I think at that time, I'm going to be load shaded once again. Uh, so. That will force me basically to go straight up to bed and uh, have like an early night because sometimes I don't have early nights. I will sleep around 1 a.m., sometimes 12 midnight, uh, which is not good. It's not good because I wake up tired anyways and then I still have to get to work. Hey, yo. What's up? It's good morning. Yeah. <laughs>
load shedding. Can you say they're gonna switch off at 10? Ah, okay. Ah, this um it spoils my plans. Cause I was planning to go out at 10 and come back at half past 12. Mm. Now 8 o'clock, it's only quarter past 8. I know people. I know, but this has spoiled my day. Senzenina, where is Senzenina? I sin bongi, sin sin suit. Ah, we are full. We are like over full. When I'm done, Shem, come 2024. See, I want to vote Got the Kanga Bonga not be A for me. Thank you. Mm. No. For anything that comes from DA, Gabong. You vote any code. Yeah, I get pedals to start in a band. Oh! My friend, oh, yeah. just a little bit, ne? I, I'm recording this small piece, ne? Yeah, yeah just uh, maybe two minutes. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, copyright. Hey guys, unfortunately, my day just got spoiled, especially my plans, because as I said earlier on, that I'm going to use the load shedding time, the two and a half hours. To go do my grocery shopping but now escom decided mm -mm, i'm not switching you off at 10 anymore i'm switching you two hours before so now i'm sitting in the dark as you guys can see in the background no lights they just went out about a few seconds ago and now i'm thinking what do i do what do i do because if I'm going to do this after work, everything's going to be rush, 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 rush. And I thought I was going to have some relaxed time and take my time while I was going to do this. But now it is what it is, people. It is what it is. And I am so ticked off. I really am. So now, anyways, guess I have to accept until 1030 when they bring back the lights. Just continue working. We will make do with what we've got. If I'm able to do my grocery shopping, then maybe you will see me doing it. If not, just know that I do not have enough time. So, yeah. Story of our lives. <laughs> Welcome to South Africa. <laughs> no, it's a great country. But our problem right now is ESCOM and the governing party because we believe that they are trying their hardest to provoke us as citizens to start running the streets and calling for the sitting president to resign. I don't think we want to involve ourselves in the internal fights. I will not be used like that, sorry. We are only going to see y'all at the ballot paper in 2024 because we are not voting. Hey everybody, so I am back at home, unfortunately due to load shedding schedule changing, I was load shedded at 8 to 10 a.m. this morning instead of 12, mm, is it 12? No, instead of 10 to 12 p.m. So that kind of like messed up my schedule to go and do some grocery shopping. So it is now, let me check, it is now uh 4 25 p.m and i think i may may take a chance and go to other festival mall or eastgate i think i might choose to go to eastgate i'm not sure 
I still have to decide because the Uber that I uh, requested for, it said Festival Mall. I might change it inside the Uber and say, no, take me to Eastgate because there's some things there that I need to get that are not at uh, Festival Mall. So I am trying to think as well uh, what to wear. I did change from my work clothes except for this t-shirt, but I'm wearing shorts right now and I'm trying to think between these Zara shoes um and these shop rights thingamajigs which one should i wear for my comfort so i'm not quite sure i think i might go for the most comfortable one because sometimes you know people with bellies bending down is an issue <laughs> Ask anybody with a belly, they'll be like bending to put on shoes and tying the laces. Like, hello, people. The, the reason why I did it like this, I did it purposefully so that I don't have to tie a knot. I just shove them uh, by the sides. That's it. So it's kind of much of a, a job and a half. But before I go to Eastgate, I also want to go and fill in my gas cylinders let me show you uh so, so i can explain what this gas cylinder for and what is the other one for so follow me follow me or let me follow you so this is my studio as you guys know this is my living room and now we are in the kitchen so if you open right here you will come across this mess plus this gas cylinder right here this gas cylinder it is five kilograms and it is four but before i take anything off here i have to close it even though it's empty i still have to close it and then remove this head this is actually for the geezer this is for the geezer this um, gas cylinder so it takes me about two and a half months because I live alone, I don't live with anyone. So it takes about two and a half months uh, for this to finish. So now it is finished, it's about a month, you know, it's about two months and a half. In fact, it's almost three months. Uh, let me put you there. That's for the geezer. <laughs> this one is for geezer. And I never removed the plastic since I bought it in February, I'm not sure why. And then the second one is the one that you guys already know. So just put that aside and unscrew the head, which is quite dirty. Okay. It's already locked in, so there is no need for me to close anything. This one also, I filled it in February. It took a good nine months to finish. So this cylinder I cook with, this cylinder is for my geezer. So that is why I have two gas cylinders and they're both <coughs> empty. So I need to get them um, filled up today and then uh, from there head on to uh, Eastgate or Festival Mall. Let's see what I decide. So that is the job that I'm going to be doing, running those errands. Secondly, I need to uh, remember to buy the medication, the old fashioned one for coughing, like Bostol, especially Bostol. That is what I need to get. And uh, so I think I am going to go with my Zara shoes uh, for this one because we're going to Eastgate. If it was Festival Mall, child, we were going to go with you. And yeah, I'm my levels, you know, how my, <laughs> <I'm> my levels. <laughs> but anyways, guys, uh, I will see you once my Uber arrives. If, I, if you know me, I hate driving. Driving is not my favorite activity. I just refuse to drive. It gives me anxiety. I sweat in places where the sun don't shine as well when I am driving. 
so yeah too much information so yeah let's do this shopping quickly this vlog is going to be posted quite late uh tonight because after i um after the mall i'm going to cook um dinner and then i still have to edit after editing and then i will export and then upload so if you are still up around 11 p.m then you'll be able to see this vlog and i also want to give a big shout out to ndibu t for sharing my videos on her channel ah every time i see what she does for me i i am close to tears i get choked with tears yeah cancers we that's how we are we are crybabies a, an act of kindness does make us cry it doesn't matter where or whom this act of kindness is done to we uh, we, we cry we cry so Ndibu already shared two of my vlogs uh the vlogtobers and i am so eternally grateful to her and thank you so much to everybody that have joined because of her being subscribed to my channel thank you welcome you're warmly you are warmly welcome to the Real Clancy's tutorials. I hope you will learn. Uh, you will also get to suss out the, the, the feel of this channel. We talk all things YouTube. Currently, we are participating. I don't know why I'm saying we. I am participating in Vlogtober. And uh, so that is why you are seeing vlogs from me. And probably yesterday, you also saw some uh, shorts from me because I did say... If you've uh, been listening to my live, um, if you've been listening to my live streams, uh, that I will be doing vlogs. I'll also be doing shorts, shorts tober, and also I'll be doing lives. So yesterday, uh, day four, it was all about uh, shorts, and I think I posted about six shorts, uh, one after the other, an hour apart or so, and then load shedding happened, and then they were two hours apart. And then from there to catch up with the uploading schedule, then they were about 40 minutes apart. So about 11 p.m. I was done. They were supposed to have all been uploaded by 9 p.m., all six of them. Unfortunately, we live in South Africa and ESCOM tells us when to breathe and when to go to bed. <laughs> Well, let me stop ranting and just, uh, okay, my Uber is here. I see the guy is calling. Um, okay, yeah, I'll see you when I'm in a car or maybe at the mall. Ooh, your, sh your feet are ashy, bro. You got ashy feet. Yeah. Yeah. The important parts of the day, meaning it's the important parts of the day. I listen, my parts are bora, you're like being in a meeting in the. That's all busy. Yeah. Exactly. But I see, let's put it in the energy. Yeah. Manji meetings were a festival. Manji, I want to. Is it all in the phone as a book of a year? I want to get a mic. If I'm going to get a mic, I'll get a mic. 
how long does it last? I mean, I'm going to get it lasted two and a half months. You? But it lasted three, Glock. This sweet! I must sweet down my knee! Love. Got a leg peg and I also. So we are here. Yes, I can look at seven. Hey, no man, guys. Got a man, we are born to connect. He can't look at his and I. Once of Fuller Mans, a bandai, I ask she's same time. Is it? Yeah. Exactly, and put it here seven and no case. Hey, that's my case. Yes, that. How many cages? I mean, in sense of five. Not nine. Is it nine? I know it's nine. You five length pair and I. Oh, length pair and I. Like, like, what is that? Go, like, what is that? Go, February, my pair of mange. Yes, I'm cousin Gizan Gala. Yes, yes. Cut in Nigeria. She bought for his pants. I hate you. 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 I I got a lot. I'm going to get a little bit of 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 a a a if uh, they pay a rent uh, hand to hand, looks like it. So we are parked at his apartment because he needs to see the um, the caretaker and pay the rent. Uh, he looks like a good guy, anyway. So I don't mind as long as the Uber driver is like they talk and friendly. I don't have a problem with that. So we are going to Eastgate, people. We are headed to Eastgate. Okay, so somebody was looking at me funny, parked next to us. So I just had to lower my camera. You know, vlogging in public is so uh, difficult. <laughs> it's actually a very strange thing to do. Uh, she's smoking this. I don't have a problem with people that smoke, that's their bodies. But she's like blowing smoke towards my direction. I'm not sure if I'm being she's being flirting with me or what. That's actually the worst way to flirt with me. With a cigarette in your mouth. You <laughs> Oh my god, sorry if you are a smoker. I did not mean to offend you. Uh it's just one of those things that are not uh things that I appreciate um, I really don't but like I said I don't have a problem if you smoke as long as you smoke far away from me I'm okay look it's just still looking at me and she has, she has a wedding band on her finger my word what's up with people Okay. Um, this is a nice. It's a new building, I think. <laughs> but anyways, let's leave it there. He's coming now, so we're on our way. See. Oh, he took a different direction. You have so many kids in this. Flat. Okay, there we go. Oh, yeah. Mm, yeah. Like, yeah. Like, long, 
No, what was when you said the last one? Oh. Okay. to get honey but that this one also used to work alleviate coughs but you know I want bustle Yeah, I saw it on YouTube, but this other YouTuber, she found it. But it's so different. <laughs> for general chronic troublesome coughs. Yeah, this is exactly what I'm looking for. Because my coughs are very troublesome. Okay, very interesting price. Mm. What's the difference between this red one? Let me just put this one in the basket. What's the difference between these two? Must buy the original. Afrikaans. Okay, let's read the English version. Original, the original one is this one. This is my favorite. Yeah. So the orange one is for uh, relief of wet coughs. I don't have wet coughs. No. Uh, peppermint for relief of wet coughs. No. The original is the best one. Hey. I need to meet your enemy, Shai Sevens. Since we. I need these as well for blood thinning and this one is you know I hate these sachets you know they try to fix a wheel that's not broken yeah, okay I think I want to get my facial stuff no, nah, I'm just looking for my facial stuff. So I finally found the bus stall. I'm so excited. Thank you, Betty. It's because of you I'm here. 
Now I'm just looking for my facial stuff. Okay, we are in the women's section, so... Stall. Yeah. Well, everything that I predicted was not going to happen today actually did happen. I could not do my um, the planned grocery when I went to Micah. Micah was already closed, so I could no longer fill up my gas cylinders. And the other stuff that I needed to buy, I couldn't buy them because we got we were stuck in traffic going to Eastgate. This is after 5 p.m. by the way. So the traffic was just insane. And so I did manage to get some few things and I think I'm just going to unpack them and show you what exactly did I buy. Unfortunately, this is no longer going to be a cooking vlog as I initially thought it was going to be. Uh, I'm trying to find the best spot for my face. Okay, there we go. No, no, ugh. I'm still not uh, okay with the lighting. So let me just show you what I bought, uh, why I bought the things that I bought. So as you can see, it is half, no, 25 past, no, wait, wait, let's see. This will be 23 past eight. Uh, that's how uh, late I got back. So just to show you the things that I bought, I bought uh, a pack of 48. Is it 48 or 16? This is supposed to be yeah. 48 large eggs from uh, Chatter's Hyper. Um, and then I bought myself... And then I bought Mini Meal. I wanted the 10 kg because it usually lasts me uh, four months. But at Checkers Hyper, as you can see, I bought it from there. Checkers Hyper, they did not have the 10 kg or the 12 kg, so I opted for this one, which is going to last me a month. Um, okay, I just realized something. And then next, I had to buy my detergents. 
handy andy i like this one the lemon flavor or lemon cream or whatever it is bought myself um sunlight liquid because that's what i use to uh, wash my dishes and stuff i bought myself uh roll-ons because i was running out of roll-ons so i just bought three nivea roll-ons and then the real reason i went out was so that i get my supplies for my um to treat my cough so i got myself this honey from this cam as you can see it's called like oh, it's a lifestyle food i think it's a lifestyle lifestyle food brand honey choice grade um what is that irrigated or whatever it's i had never seen that word before it's one kilogram i also decided to buy apple cider vinegar uh, i don't know why i bought apple cider vinegar but i just bought it and the star of the whole thing that made me to go to ace gate was because of bustle this was inspired by gardening with betty uh, she reminded me that, by the way, we used to have old school cough mixture. Uh, Bustle was one of those that I grew up on when I was sick and I would be healed. So I was like, definitely I'm going for that one too. So I had to buy sachets of grandpa. Uh, this is usually for blood thinning and stuff like that. So when you are a big boy, you need to also uh, buy these kind of supplies like this spring, the one that dissolves in water uh you also need some grandpa of course this is not something you take every day uh for me it lasts me six months this one because i take one uh per week or something and then i take this one maybe twice a week so if this one finishes quicker than this one uh, i usually take this when i go to bed um yeah and then because I, you guys know, I like doing my, uh, my face. So I decided to buy myself a charcoal, uh, pillow facial mask. Uh, I've used this one before and I enjoyed it. I liked what it did to my skin. So I bought that. And I also bought, okay. Now this was not planned. These lights were not planned. This was. An expenditure I did not uh, plan for. As you guys know, load shedding is now part of our lives for now. I hope for now. And so when it gets really dark in my place, when uh, there's load shedding, so I need these to illuminate my house during the evening um, load shedding. So basically, that is that that I bought in Eastgate. Uh, yeah, I think I'm fine with this. All of this I'm fine with. And um, yeah, there's something else that I forgot. Oh yeah, I knew that. Sorry, there's another plastic <laughs> for stuff that I forgot <laughs> that I bought, sorry. So of course, because I no longer drink Coke, I decided to buy myself juice. I also ran out of cooking oil, so I bought some cooking oil. I bought myself some uh, soup sachets, um, chicken and mutton curry. I bought that. And of course, because tonight I wanted to cook macaroni, um, that, in fact, yeah, I wanted to cook macaroni with tin fish inspired by Ui, huh? Inspired by Uzwilena. Uzwilena, this is a YouTube channel. Uh, I know I've never asked for a name though. Um, so she did, um, a, a, a pasta, um, uh, Lucky Star, uh, pilchard dinner and i wanted to have the same dinner tonight and uh so i was inspired by her to do that unfortunately i cannot do uh that cooking um so i can't make that dinner tonight because 
I <coughs> because I do not have uh, a gas I don't have gas in my gas cylinder and then of course I bought ginger the reason why I bought ginger is because um, um, my label gave me a home remedy to get rid of my persistent cough she said I should get uh, uh, what do you call this ground ginger where I will take half a teaspoon of it with honey and uh, I think a teaspoon or a, a tablespoon of um, a lemon there were no lemons at um, yeah there were no lemons at uh, Checkers Hyper so it's something that I'm going to have to do tomorrow and then I bought myself uh, these uh, chicken seasoning is it chicken no, I just use it for everything anyways. It's for grilling, basically. I enjoy having that in my food. Of course, I bought two extra tin fish. Uh, just to have it lying around in case I am lazy to cook. So basically, guys, this is what I had bought. It's not all of it. It's something that will sustain me for the rest of the month. So yeah i am unhappy with that i could not fill up these but tomorrow definitely they'll be filled up so it's cold water tonight for me and in the morning when i wake up to work but the most exciting thing for me right now is this bustle i'm very very excited about this because at least i can now uh work on getting rid of this persistent cough that i've been having in the past month so now if you're wondering what i'm going to be eating tonight since i'm no longer going to um cook i decided to go to chicken licking so chicken licking is my dinner tonight let me just show you uh, So chicken licking is my dinner tonight. So let's see how the pieces look inside. Ah, there we go. So you have the french fries or the chips and six pieces. Okay, yeah, six pieces because I will eat two or three tonight and then I'm going to carry some to work for my lunch. So that is what I'm eating tonight. I'm going to be drinking it. Usually I would drink it with Coke, but I'll be drinking it with this mango flavor juice. It's 100% mango, by the way. It's not, there are no preservatives, nothing of that nature. It's pure mango. And I love this brand Crush. Uh, you should try it out from Clover. If you ever want to get yourself 100% uh, fruit uh, juice. Yeah, so that is this. This is my grocery, guys, and my dinner. So thank you so much, guys. Okay, let me just do this. Let me close the vlog properly. So, guys, thank you so much for watching my day five of October 2022. Um, this was a mess, I must confess. Uh, I was thrown off by the load shedding schedule that was two hours before, no, in fact, four hours before. No, man, it was two hours before because I expected to be load shedded from 10 a.m. to 12.30 p.m., but instead they uh, load shedded us at 8 a.m. to 10.30 so of course i couldn't escape the two hours to run and do the proper shopping that i wanted to do and also get to do other things that i needed to do the reason why my gas cylinders were not filled was because i ran out of time by the time we got to mica it was closed and uh, going to eastgate i knew that if we're going to festival mall things there uh shops would, would have been closed so my best shot was uh, was going to Eastgate. Uh, indeed, when I got to Eastgate, 
basically gates were beginning to close or the doors were beginning to close but we just uh, ran right through with so yeah guys thank you thank you again for watching thank you for your support i thought i was going to do uh youtube topics in between this vlog but unfortunately i guess will be something that i have to do in the next vlog because there are some things that i wanted to talk about regarding youtube uh and your youtube channel and your youtube journey so it's something that you'll have to do in the next vlog so let me just say goodbye right now thank you for watching do subscribe and also click the bell notification so that you get notified every time i upload a new vlog or a new youtube related video or a short tour so please do leave me a comment down below and uh tell me what to improve with my vlogs i am learning this is this is the first time i have committed to doing vlogs and i'm enjoying the process even though today was quite frustrating and uh yeah let me stop talking share this vlog as far as you can because hey your boy needs to trigger the algorithm as well also, give it a like. Hey, see you again.